coming to you live from the Mac Studio. It's Whitney High School Live, and I'm your host, Ben Espejo. Well, hey guys, welcome to Wednesday's edition of Whitney High School Live and the third day in our week of What is Love. Thank you to our house band for their wonderful edition, rendition of Thinking Out Loud by Ed Sheeran. And now I'm going to introduce the segment producer, Raji Ganapathy. Thank you, Ben. Welcome to the What is Love game show where three of Whitney High's power couples will battle it out for the title of Couple of the Week. Let's meet our contestants. First up, we have seniors Jeremy and Josephine, followed by Lauren and Dwight, and Jordan and Michelle. Throughout the course of this game show, our lovely contestants will be tested on how well they know their SO. Good luck, guys. Let's begin the show. Round one is called Popping the Question. Our guys will guess the, their girlfriend's answers to these questions. Our girls have previously written down their answer. If they guess correctly, one point. Let's begin. Jeremy, what is your girl's dream vacation spot? Uh, uh, Hawaii. Ooh, is let Josephine? Let's see your answer. Oh, Jeremy, it looks like that is the incorrect answer. No points for you. Dwight, what is your girl's dream vacation spot? <laughs> um. Greece. Ooh. No points for you either, Dwight. Let's kick it over to Jordan and Michelle. Jordan, what is your girl's dream vacation spot? Hmm. I'm, I'm going to go with Hawaii, too. Ooh. Congratulations. Jordan and Michelle, one point. Okay. Next question. Jordan, if your girl had to eat the same food for the rest of her life, what would it be? Definitely uh, kimchi. <laughs> Ooh, incorrect. No points for you guys. Dwight, what is your girl's uh, favorite food? What would she eat for the rest of her life? Come on, Dwight. Uh, <laughs> nachos? Correct. One point for you guys. Ooh. All right, Jeremy, what would your girl eat for the rest of her life? Uh, noodles. Uh, <laughs> looks like that is incorrect, Jeremy. All right, so first round, we're tied. Dwight and Lauren and Jordan and Michelle, one point each. Round two is acted out, where we'll be acting out some of our favorite love stories, charade style. So if uh, Jeremy and Josephine could step up on stage, please. Yes. Okay. You have 15 seconds starting now. Uh, Titanic. That is correct. One point for Jeremy and Josephine. Okay. Dwight and Lauren, step up, please. Okay, 15 seconds, starting now. Five seconds. Oh, The Little Mermaid? Yes, that is correct. <laughs> One point for Lauren and Dwight. Okay, Jordan and Michelle. Fifteen seconds starting now. Five seconds. Oh, you guys ran out of time. The <coughs> correct answer was Lady and the Tramp. <laughs> okay, okay. Bonus round um, titled, Are You My Baby? Guys, we're going to have to ID correctly whether this is Bay or some random baby. Let's start with Jorn and Michelle. Michelle, or Jorn, is this Bay or some random baby? That is definitely a random. Oh, that's a random baby. Uh, 
That is <coughs> correct. That is not Michelle. Uh, one point for you guys. Okay. Um, Lauren and Dwight. Uh, Dwight, is this Bay or some random baby? That's. <laughs> that's Bay. That's a Bay. That's that's her. Yes, that is correct. One point for Lauren and Dwight. <coughs> okay. Um, Josephine, is this Bay or some random baby? Oh, that's Bay. That is correct. That is Bay. That's Jeremy. Thank you, guys. So it looks like Lauren and Dwight, you are our winners. You are a couple of the week at Whitney High School. Thank you all for participating on our What is Love Week game show. Let's kick it over to Ben and Lisa for some lo love advice with Lisa. Thank you, Raji. Well, Lisa, today's question is, do you have any advice for any middle school students who are interested in pursuing a relationship? Take it away. Thank you, Ben. So first, it's really important to consider what it actually means to be in a relationship. What does that look like? What does that entail? Relationships take a lot of hard work and sacrifice. It's not just about you anymore. You really have to work on incorporating another person into your life. And that takes a lot of maturity. Another thing is, even though you see others dating, it doesn't mean that you need to be dating too. It's really okay to be single. Um, also, just to touch on a little bit about what we talked about yesterday, um, it's really important to keep in mind your parents' views on you dating. If you do decide to date without your parents' permission, keep in mind that you do live with them, and it's very possible that they may find out about your relationship. So make sure that you're prepared to deal with those consequences. Finally, regardless of whether or not you're in a relationship, keep in mind that middle school is a time to really focus on your education, but not only that, but about learning about yourself. Um, it's really important to know yourself so that you can incorporate yourself into a healthy relationship. It's all about that self-love and respect. Back to you, Ben. Thank you, Lisa. Now, one last um, announcement. Uh, if you're interested in participating in Career Day, pre-registration ends Friday. Now, that's all for today. This has been Whitney High School Live. I'm Ben Espejo. Have a great day, and I'll see you tomorrow.